Hello guys, today I'm going to be reading the 21 Irrefutable Laws of Leadership. The Law of Magnetism. Who you are is who you attract. Effective leaders are always on the lookout for good people. Well, John Maxwell thinks each of us carries around a mental list of what kind of people we would like to have in our organization or department. Think about it. Do you know who you're looking for right now? What is your profile or perfect of perfect employees? What quantities would they possess? Do you want them to be aggressive and entrepreneurial? Are you looking for leaders? Do you care whether they're in their 20s, 40s, or 60s? Stop, stop right now. Take a moment and make a list of the quantities you'd like people on your team. Find a pencil or a pen and do it now. And do it now before you read any further. So, basically, uh, you don't have to do this part. Like, it's just like, you know. Because, like, it, it actually even have what has, like, unless if you've already read it, then you know what's in here. But, like, it has a part spot where you can write in it, actually. That's fine. Anyways, I'm just going to move on. Now, what will determine what sort of people you want and are the people you get and whether they will possess the qualities you desire? I think I may have said quantities before instead of qualities. You might be surprised. Uh, by the answer. I believe it or not, who you attract is not determined by what you want. It's by ter- it's determined by who you are. Go back to the list you made and each and for each character character characteristic you identify decide whether you possess that quality. For example, if you wrote that you would like great leaders and you are an excellent leader, that's a match. Put a check mark by it. But if your leadership is no better than average, put an X and write only average leader next to it. If you wrote that you want people who are entrepreneurial and you possess that quality, put a check. Otherwise, mark it as an X and so on. Now, review the whole list. If you see a bunch of Xs, then you are in trouble. Because people you describe are not the type of who, want, who will want to follow you in most situations unless you are... Unless you take strong measure, measures to counteract it, you draw people to, to you draw people to who you possess the same qualities you do. That's the law of magnetism. Who you are is who you attract. So the qualities that you possess are the like people you're gonna get. <laughs> and I, and that, I feel like it rhymes. Well, like basically, so let's say you want someone who like can make paper airplanes. First, if you want someone who can make paper airplanes, you must make pre- you must know how to make paper airplanes first. So I'm asking kids, how kids come up with their mom, dad, and apartment prescriptions written by my mom until she got 50 apartments in seven years. Then aliens do my homework is my book. It's about a kid and aliens who steal some work. So like, subscribe. Bye.